Hello and welcome. For this Canvas tip, I'm going to show you one of the things that I absolutely love in Canvas, and that is just how easy it is to share, copy, and collaborate with others. On our former LMS, it's learning, you know, that sometimes you can share things, but there are lots of clicks involved in making a copy of things just to get your own copy where you don't interfere with the original owner and their version of it. On Canvas, it is super easy to share lots of different things in different ways. It just depends on your audience and who you want to reach. So one of the things that I love is that it's super easy to share individual resources as well as entire modules with other people. So I'm gonna show you an example here. I'm in a sample course where I have some things built out. And if I want to share maybe this entire module with someone that I work with pretty often, or if I just wanna copy this into another course, if it's something that I wanna use, but wanna tweak it some for the different classes that I teach, it's really easy to do. So if I wanna do this for the whole module, I'm gonna go over here to the name of the module, click this three dot button, and here is where I have all of my options. So I can duplicate this in the module itself, which means if I have a pretty good template going here in a pretty consistent format, there's only a couple things that I want to plug in and change, I can duplicate it so I don't have to keep typing the same things over and over again. So that's just a helpful thing for copying. I can copy this too, which gives me the option to copy this into a different course. So I can select it and I type in the name of the course where I want this to go into. Um, so I can select the course where I want to add this into, so I can copy it in and then I'll be set. So that's a pretty awesome example. Click copy and you're good. The other ways that you can copy things is if I only want to do individual resources, like if I only want this overview, again, I have the same option here. I can duplicate it here or I can copy to another place. If I open the resource and I'm not in this like module view, I also have that same option to copy it somewhere. Again, copy to, I don't have the option to duplicate right here, but I can copy this into another place. You have these options anywhere where you see this three dot menu. So if I technically went to my assignments menu in my course, and if there are assignments that I wanna copy and send elsewhere, I can copy all of them, <laughs> or I can just click this three dot button and copy and send them somewhere else. The other thing that I wanna show you that's super awesome about Canvas and the ability to easily share things with others and collaborate with others is you have more options than just copying this into another course. You could certainly copy this into a teacher's course that maybe you collaborate with, your grade level team, whatever have you, and copy it right into their course. But if you want to give them a little bit more autonomy on how they want that arranged in their course, you can also just send it to them. So if I click this three dot button, the other way that I can share this with someone else and we can collaborate on it and they get their own version of it essentially where it's their own copy to build from, their own working template they can edit and manipulate however they want. If I click this send to button, I can type in a user's name. They pop up and I can keep typing additional names. So if I put other people in my department, or if I wanna share this with my department chair or the other people in my grade level planning team at the elementary, for example, I can easily do that right here. Um, and you should be able to type in pretty much everyone in your building and other buildings as well. So if you work across different buildings, should be able to do that and send it to them. What they will get is an email notification saying that you have shared something with them. And they will also get a little banner across their sign in screen, the home button for elementary or the dashboard button for middle school and high school, they'll get a notification there saying that someone has shared content with them and if they would like to accept that shared content. And from there, they can select what course they want that to be moved into. So pretty amazing there. It's a really awesome way where you can share things with others. And same thing goes here. If I want to share an entire module, I could share this whole thing send it to that person, it is theirs. I could also do individual items too. So I can share individual uh, assignments here, individual pages, quizzes, everything. So technically the best way to share a rubric is to have it associated with an assignment and then you share the assignment with the person. So if I go to my assignments and let's say that I really liked this screencast rubric that I made for a project, then Whenever we get to that assignment, I can just click the three dot button and send it to someone. And then not only do they have my assignment, but now they have my rubric. And once you share an assignment that has a rubric with someone, then they have that rubric, it's their own copy, and they can make 
copies of it. They can edit it. They can use it as a template when they build other assignment rubrics. So it is theirs. So that's probably the best way to share rubrics with other people. There is a feature in Canvas where we can basically publish rubrics for a whole building or for a whole department that basically can be crowdsourced ones. That's something that admins can do in Canvas. Um, so if you have a need for that, you can certainly reach out and we can help you in that process. That would be really helpful if you use like a common rubric for different projects across a grade level or even like senior projects, something along those lines, if you're wanting to have some consistency there. Uh, the other thing that you can do to share and easily collaborate with others on Canvas is just using the Canvas Commons. So I referenced this in an earlier tip when you were looking for homepage templates, but the Canvas Commons is very similar to the It's Learning Library. The It's Learning Library is where you could publish things and basically anyone to be CSE, or if you make it to a wider audience, anyone who uses this learning could copy and access those resources and put them in their own courses. Similar concept here. The Canvas Commons is this shared space where you can publish resources, you can look for different resources here, they're all tagged, and you can copy them into your courses. So I have published a few here for you, some templates for you to build from and to learn how to use Canvas homepage features and some best practices, but there are tons of things here. You can actually publish an entire course to the Canvas Commons. So if you build out a model course and really love it and want other people to be able to learn from your experience, you can publish an, an entire course to the Canvas Commons. And you can also find entire courses in the Canvas Commons, as well as modules, pages, quizzes, assignments, all of those things. So if you're wanting to look for something, you can look for a specific name. You can even filter it by the type of file it is. So if you're looking for sample courses, sample modules, you can do all of that. You can look for the different grade levels that it's tagged with. And that's a great way to search for things. So that is one way to access things. But if you're wanting to share something to the Canvas Commons, what you'll do is go into your course. And it's a very similar process to where we just were when we were copying things but I'm gonna go into my course here. And it's the same for elementary and secondary. There's nothing, nothing different here other than a few more clicks to get to the menu. And if I go to a module, I have some options. So if I would like, I can share individual resources or an entire module, same thing, three dot button, share to commons, and I can publish it there so other people can see it. I can set the settings so that only people in BCSE can access this if I know that I don't want it out there for anyone and everyone to see. So that's pretty neat. The other thing that I can do is if I'm wanting to share my entire course, I also have that capability in those options. So if I go into my course here in Canvas, uh, on elementary, you'll have to click Manage Subject in the top left corner. And I'm going to scroll down and I will click settings if I'm on secondary view. Elementary, as soon as you click manage subject, it takes you to the screen right away. But if I look over here, I have some different options. So technically, I could copy this entire course. So if I build this out and I know I want to use a lot of the same content in here in a course for next year, I can copy this course and it allows me to use all these things next year. So that is one option that you have. If you want to publish something to the Canvas Commons, basically this entire course, I can click share to Commons, and then this whole entire course could become available for other people to look at and to use as a model. So thought I would show you that, just some different ways that you can share and collaborate with others, and it's so easy and there's far fewer clicks than what we're used to. So I hope this increases your ability to share across your building and departments, and I hope you're excited. Let me know if you have questions.